Welcome back to Miss Universe. Well, to make it this far, our three finalists have gone through the preliminaries, the swimsuit competition, evening gown, the selection panel Q&A, and the final question. 80 began this journey in 7070. 77 are now like us, watching to see who is worthy to wear the crown. But there's one more chance for our final three to impress the selection panel. It's called the final look. And it could mean all the difference between being a runner-up and becoming the next Miss Universe. The final three will be joined by a talented trio of singers performing Hallelujah in three languages, English, Hebrew, and Arabic. But I've heard there was a secret chord That David played and it pleased the Lord But you don't really care for music, do you? It goes like this, the fourth, the fifth The minor fall, the major lift The barefoot can compose him Hallelujah, hallelujah One more time for our top three. Carson, Chesley, your thoughts. Wow, how beautiful was that? Like wiping tears off of yeah. each other's eyes. We were both up here getting a little emotional. Yeah. You know, any one of these three women could win this very easily. And I just thought that was a great moment 
you know, to show all of these cultures coming together on this yes. stage. It's a competition, yes, but it's also a celebration of incredible women doing amazing things all over the world. I couldn't agree more. And this is a special moment for whoever wins, whoever becomes you know, the 70th Miss Universe. But the women who don't win, the other top two, they made it to the top three at Miss Universe exactly. and represented their country as well. So very exciting these women. I think it's going to be somebody from Earth that wins. It always is. <laughs> it always is somehow. Biased. Well, we're just moments away from finding out who will be on the next Miss Universe. It's coming up live on Fox. Straight hair, better flat, never settle. All new cream salt stand out straight. Now with